Hey, hi everyone. So welcome to Code Karo, Mosh Karo, and today I'm going to share my TV experience with the IBM. So I appeared as a front-end developer, senior front-end developer role with React Cheers as a technology. So we had the three rounds. One one uh, first one was the technical round. Second one was the technical plus manual round, and the third one was the uh, HR round where we had the salary discussion and everything. So we will start one by one, and I will show what all questions are asked to me. and uh, we will start with the first round which is the technical one so let's go to the screen now so in the first uh, technical round so they started with my normal introduction then they jumped to this html css basics they talked about the asked me about the doc type box model semantic tags and in uses and how it's uh, been used and how it is affecting the seo and accessibility then the different positions such as iterative absolute fix and sticky what difference they hold from one another then the inline uh, elements block elements and the inline block elements how they are different then they jumped into js concept which is the javascript concept concepts starting with the let var and const then how each of them are different and then the hosting promises event loop and null versus undefined then the equal to and double equal to Uh, double equal to and triple equal to difference and the ESX features such as the spread or the rest operator and then the output based questions are there which are related to this double equal to and triple equal to itself. So and then in the last they had the React questions so how, like how React is being different from the Angular, what it, what is virtual DOM and what is actual DOM, how what is the difference between them, what is reconciliation, what are the hooks. i have used and what is our, what are the optimization techniques such as the lazy loading or the use memo or the use uh, callback hooks are there then the reference between the props and the state and they also asked me about the ref and the forward ref forward ref also and then in the last api was given and it was the products lists a product it was a api which was fetching the uh, list of the products and i have to show that on the ui in the form of a drop down list and that will allow the selection of the particular product from that uh, list and it will show on the ui that was a simple one so this all questions were asked in the first round i will share the details in the uh, description of the video and then in the second round which was the managerial and technical round so for this first round no uh, i didn't got any mail confirmation only the call was there from the hr that uh first round has been cleared and you have been moved forward for the second round in the second round they all again started my introduction then they deep dive into my projects like what all roles and responsibility which i had and what are the technologies which i have used what are the uh, state management technology uh, techniques which i have used such as the context api or the uh, or the redux and then they also asked me about the writing test cases so i do have the uh, experience in writing the test cases also so they gave me a scenario where this there is a ui and input field is there and a submit button is there and on the click on the submit button a api call is being made and the list or the table is being shown shown on the ui so i had to break it down into the different test cases and uh, how i will proceed so that only they have asked me so then after that they asked me about a code pr and deployment process which i have been following in my pro, uh, project and in the last they gave me a code where i had to debug it so it was a code sandbox uh, code sandbox link and the code was already there it was having some bugs which i had to resolve and after that i the last round was the hr round and where we had a salary discussion and the final offer was being rolled out so if you want like what exact question what was given to me you can just comment it down i will share in the next video and if there are any other doubts like how i managed the three months notice period what all other offers i have i was having and why i chose the ibm and what was my experience in making a switch and that's all from my end and if you have any other question please write in the comment box and i will make sure i answer all the questions which are there so thank you for watching this video and please do subscribe like comment and share this code karo watch karo thank you so much bye bye